Here we are. Another day. It's Wednesday. Decided to get a little challenging today, pardon me, as I adjust my desk here for a moment. We're doing, as you can see, called a rural world. Since this is kind of rural where I'm living now, I'd like to uh, challenge myself. I have a feeling this will probably be uh, a bit more difficult than the previous one. Um, they did say no photospheres or blurry images. Some of these would be hard, but others you could guess country, they said. So uh, we're going with that. And you're going to have to live with these Java updates and other ones maybe saying that I'm running out of space on one of my drives, which surprises me a little bit. Uh, okay. I feel a very Atlantic, North Atlantic coast feel to this here. I don't know exactly where, but this is what I'm getting. Anyway, here we are. Uh, well, when this is going up, this will be Wednesday. A few days still in the move, still unpacking stuff, still very much realizing how little empty space I have in this that I feel an obligation to fill with junk, and it's just going to happen. Like, it's, I'm just going to accumulate crap that I'm going to have to move when I... Um, move out of this, which probably going to be in a year. That's that's kind of my plan. Manx gas. It doesn't help me. I was hoping that some of these photos would have come out well, but they didn't. So we move on. Um, yeah. I guess it's an inevitability when you move into a place that you're going to get Ballaghini, huh? Hairs Visitor Center. Balagini that feels maybe closer to Wales. Is there an Ayers? I did see the videos. I haven't watched them of that guy who's just trying to do like a straight line across a country. Um, didn't bother watching it though. As I just said beforehand, I'm gonna click here for now. This very well could be uh, Ireland. Ireland guess I just. Accidentally clicked off here when I went to go do this, but um, uh, let's go through the checklist of things I got to do. Thank you all for the watching, all the comments, research into golf links. Uh, maybe we're up here. Hmm. And now I feel we're shifting this way a bit. Uh, is there going to be a flag? I don't think we're actually allowed to go down that road. No, I got a minute left. Thank you, one person who I can almost always rely on to. If they don't know, they do a little bit of research to find the answer for me. Um, about the native language of Malta. And basically that. Uh, give me a sec. I needed to take a drink. Um, yeah. It's always appreciated when someone does a legwork for me for a thought I have at the moment, but then, honestly, I forget 30 seconds later because I have the memory of a goldfish. I'm trying to fix, but, you know, it's very slow. I got 28 seconds, and I have not seen Ramsey and Point of Air, A-10. Is there an A-10 here? Shit. Okay, we're up here. A-9. Give me an A10. A10? A10. A10. Oh, we were on the Isle of Man. I did not expect that. Where they have the cool little race with the motorcycle. That scares the shit out of me whenever I see any, like, wreck compilations they do. Okay, this is America. I'm saying this right now. Oh, uh, yeah, if you ever want to see, like, how crazy some people are with... Okay, maybe we're not. We're in, uh... This region of the world, surprisingly. With, uh... The Paraguay, Argentina, Brazil, Chile, and Uruguay. We're... This region down here. I'm going to click in Argentina just... To centralize ourselves, because we're going to be down in this region, I believe. 
Uh, yeah, rambling train of thought, which just seems to happen where I start off by thanking you for watching. And if you have any suggestions, comments, questions, concerns, or map suggestions, go ahead and put them in the comments below. I'll look at them. Do thanking those for doing some research for me, too. I'm going off on Isle of Man racing compilation videos of people who crash. And a little sprinkle of me just not looking forward to the move I just did. Where it really wasn't that much of a pain, but it was just stressful. There's like zero reason for it to be stressful, but my brain just made it that way. Trinidad, huh? San Jose. That Bolivia. Bolivar. Hmm. Trinidad and San... On 14. All right. I think we might be in this country. Here's 14. We're looking for Trinidad and San Jose. Oh, we, we do some zigzagging here, huh? There's Trinidad and San Jose. I think we're around here. This is Paraguay? Oh, it's Uruguay. Okay. Yeah, it's 25 miles and then whatever San Jose. Did I just see it? Let's zoom out a bit. I don't really see it circling here, but it's got to be close. All right. Moving on. Is there any other thoughts I have? I'm sure there's there's always at least some garbage I can spew out. If it really wasn't for that bus and seeing it and stopping and looking like that, I don't know if I actually would have been able to pinpoint this. I might have gotten confused with the San Jose and the Trinidad, maybe thinking this is Mexico. Unless, like, I happen to look at another sign coming up here, but I doubt I will. Like, is this actually a house at some point? Like, how long ago did somebody live here? And how long ago did they stop? Assuming that it is actually a house, I don't know. Oh. That's the interesting thing about rural. And I'm now kind of, at least, it feels kind of bad and almost like touristy to think of this too, but kind of like, going around at least where i am now and like actively going out of my way to be like oh this is a cool little shop i'm gonna spend money here and like going out of my way to spend money in the local area here and you know it feels almost like i'm going in there like oh guys aren't you cute with your tiny little uh business in here thinking you can do what they do in the big cities isn't that cute oh here's some little money please keep doing this for my entertainment later when i'm just like <clears throat> Excuse me. Just like, okay, this feels... Greenland, Iceland, definitely up here. And, like, I recently heard that there's this little general store in a small town that they drive through to go to work that is on a consult... Is this a soccer field? It's like in doing a consolidation thing just because there having trouble staying open and I'm going out of my way to like stop there get some stuff and I don't know there, there there's this really good sketch that I remember from uh, uh what was it South Park okay we've got orthodoxy this is a real old church hmm and uh like they want to support they, they hate Walmart for coming in and taking all their business. Why is this such a slow incline? And they, like, we never want to support business to come in this big, you know, and eventually they support a little small business and they keep throwing money at it. And eventually it becomes a huge big business and then it basically becomes Walmart and they're like, well, remember, we'll make sure to never do this again. And it's just kind of like this cycle of, you can throw money. Oh, God, this is Russia. Hmm. Well, the orthodoxy, I guess that 
I guess that makes sense. This is a very fancy oh, hmm, souvenir shop. Oh boy. What is this? This is gonna stump me so hard, I think. Hmm. Like, they they feel like at some point they tried to... Oh god, I'm going backwards. Get me up the hill here. Oh, what is happening? I'm getting angry. What? Why do we keep going backwards? I don't want to go backwards. This is like a... Okay, here we go. Let me go up this goddamn road. Very slowly, like they tried to make a big fancy thing here, like multiple times over. Like maybe back in the 70s they tried, it didn't work out. Then they tried like 20 years ago and it's like questionably working out. And you know, 100 years before that there was a thing here. All right, now I have to specifically move my mouse in certain positions to actually be able to move up here. It's going to take me so long to get to the top here. Oh my god, I'm very impatient. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to get up here in time. I'm going to do this a bunch. Hmm. I just I just had it. There we go. Thank you. 30 seconds, man. This is this is stupid hill is going to... I gotta make a guess. Okay. Nacha Chelv Convin Hmm. This is not the Faroe Islands. Is it really like up here? Krasino? Like we are out on the water, I'm, like, this can be any, this could even be over here, like in Petra, oh, we're in Svalbard, huh? Oh. Well, I'm not too upset with that, but honestly, I, I had no zero idea I was going to guess that, but hey, that's about as rural as you can get. Speaking of which, this is a uh, coastline, kind of like a rice field set up with some, is this like Greece? Like Baltic Europe, or just a random coastline along Chile. I see a building. It's, I can't really see, I thought I saw like a mountain off to the side there. I do not. Oh, we've got tropical palm tree stuff. Can't make out the writing. Hmm, it's just the Mediterranean now. Got cactuses. That's a view. Very little trees. Hmm, okay, we've got a sign. This will help me figure out. Except to render service in the street. Okay, I don't understand that. Maybe we're in Turkey? Because Turkey kind of has a weird... Nope, okay, yeah, we're back on Malta. Because <laughs> there's those weird H's again. Okay. Malta twice in two videos. That's pretty crazy. Um, let's look over here again. Because we... Hondo Bay. Okay, we've got... A point of reference for Hondo... Hondok. Hmm. I'm not seeing it. I don't think it's that big of a bay. Let's just go around the coast. 
and see if we don't see it. We do not. I wonder if that's where all the corgis are. Okay. We do not see Hondok Bay. I'm going to go this way. So we've got the area exactly which island, I don't know. Treek, Tabsalik. We're going to go this way. Be very claustrophobic to go down these. Ooh, Semburai. This is pretty nice looking out here, though. Ave Maria, huh? All right, let's try to head towards the center so we can see maybe a town name or something. That is definitely not. All right. Uh, I don't know where Hondok Bay is. I got 40 seconds. Try to get... Nope, not that red sign maybe, but I don't feel like it would have helped me. Hmm. Uh, we're going to go this way. Come on. Thank you. Got a little park. 16 seconds. Okay. Um, you're overlooked. I think we're like here. Let's maybe a Honda will pop up here. Like maybe here. No, oh, there's Hondoc. Well, we're doing this thing again. Uh, we'll close you. There we go. Yeah, Hondoc right there. Okay. Wasn't that far off. I like this map. You know, it's challenging, but I don't know if it's just because I've got kind of lucky. I mean, Svalbard or whatever it was, that one was definitely a bit more difficult. Lipova. Okay, I think we're in Central to Eastern Europe. Let's see if Strab, I don't recognize that um, beer name. Utseki Kraj. This could now, I almost feel, it could be Romania. Slovakia. We're kind of in this area, I believe. But we're super rural here. Um, oh, we're at the end. All right, let's head home and go the other way. Get out. Keep clicking real fast till we can actually get to a decent sized road. And maybe go, um, Honed this down a bit more as far as where we are. Come on. I see a town in the distance. It's got those red roofs that a lot of Czech buildings do. Okay, no one's got their flag outside their, their uh, home. Okay, now I almost feel like that we could be here too. Let's see. Got railroad tracks. It's in English with the stop. Hmm. I don't know. I'm still a little torn here. Let's see. Uh, see these little markers on top of their letters. I'm not. There was this flow chart somebody sent of just realizing where you are in Europe, but it was it, it was about as opposite as helpful as it could be. This fencing makes me feel that we could be in a former Soviet Socialist Republic, but I'm probably really stretching with that. This is just me thinking out loud. Hopefully trying to get maybe towards the center of town where they're actually going to say, or have a flag of what this place is. Um, nothing here. 
Krejova. Hmm. Kotlet. No, that doesn't help me. It would if I understood the language, but clearly I don't. Hmm. Let's go this way. Okay, we got Bavarian buildings. Or Bavarian style buildings. 30 seconds. Hotel Ron. We got Pilsner Urquell. So I know Pilsner Urquell is a Czech thing. So I'm going to hedge our bets here. Although, it's a pretty ubiquitous beer. Does not really mean that... uh. We are in check, but I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm just putting ourselves kind of in a, ooh, 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 we've got local signage. None of that helps me. All right, where are we? Oh, so we were just at the border. Technically still in check, so I got the country right. Not bad. You know, other than that awful one, it wasn't too, too bad. Got over 20,000, pretty happy with that, but. That's going to do it for a Wednesday. You're officially free to go. Do the rest of your Wednesday. I've held you up long enough. As always, as I said earlier, thank you all for watching. Like, favorite, comment, subscribe. Tell me your thoughts, comments, questions, concerns, complaints, map suggestions, any suggestion. I'll look at them and get back to you as soon as possible. That's the feeling of a Wednesday when it's done. Knowing that Friday's going to be here real soon. I can't wait. We'll see you soon.